In this call control tutorial for Digium IP phones, we'll discuss placing a call on hold, managing multiple calls, conferencing, transferring, and last number redial. To place an active call on hold, press the hold feature key. The display will show the call is held. To resume the call, press the resume soft key. If you are on a call and another call comes in, you will hear the call waiting tone. The line key will flash and the second call will appear on your display. To answer the call, press the line key. The original call will be placed on hold. You can navigate between multiple calls using the arrow keys. Select Resume to speak to that party or end call to hang up. If you have multiple accounts configured on your phone, a call coming into another account will cause the line key to flash. You can answer the call by pressing the line key. The previous call will be placed on hold. You will see the hold status icon and the line key will flash red. You can navigate between multiple calls on multiple accounts by placing your current call on hold using the hold feature key. You will see a list of all of the active calls to any account configured on the phone. Navigate to a call and select resume to speak to that party. Call conferencing allows you to create a three-way call with two other parties. When you are on an active call, press the conference soft key. This will place your current call on hold, allowing you to place another call. You can do so by entering digits and pressing the dial key or from your contact application. When the third party answers the call, press conference again to join both calls together. Your screen will display the active call icon for both calls. In this state, pressing end call will hang up on both parties. To cease the conference and act on each call individually, press the split key. This will place both parties on hold. You can now resume each call individually. The inactive call will remain on hold. If you have two individual active calls and you would like to conference them together, you can highlight the active call and press conference. Select the second call, press resume, then conference. Both calls will now be conferenced together. To transfer an active call, press the transfer feature key. This will place your current call on hold, allowing you to place another call. You can do so by entering digits or from the contacts application. You then have three options for call transfer. Pressing the transfer soft key will immediately send the call to the third party. This is often referred to as a blind transfer. Pressing the dial soft key keeps your original call on hold while a new call is placed to the third party. When they answer, you can speak to them about the call you'd like to transfer. Then press the transfer soft key to send the call to their phone. This type of transfer is often referred to as an assisted transfer. Finally, you can transfer a call directly to the voicemail box of another Switchbox user. To do so, press the transfer VM soft key. Note that this option is only available when using the contacts app to transfer calls. Pressing the redial feature key will place a call to the last number dialed. You can access a history of your dialed calls from the call log.